What is up guys, welcome to another video, so in this video we got another trading method on the channel and in this video we are going to be taking a look at staff trading. So basically the first thing you want to start off with is that I want to scroll through these items, get to know them a little bit, as you can see here we have goalkeeper coaches, this is, this, this is the only thing you don't want to do, you don't want to bid on goalkeeper coaches, they are basically worthless. What you want to bid on is fitness coaches, physio coaches and managers, you can also do managers but yeah, head coaches, physio coaches and fitness coaches are the main things you want to bid on. So basically what you want to do, you want to find their lowest buy now first. For example, fitness coaches, I believe they are going for about 250 coins, might go for a little bit more. As you can see right now, they are indeed going for a little bit more than 250 coins. We'll take this up to 300 coins now, see if we can get anything here now. So as you can see, now we have a few, you know, I only have a few here for 300 coins. So basically what I'm going to do then is that you want to uh, try to make 100 coins on each card. What you want to do is go, go um, uh, buy, and then you want to go max buy 200 coins, and after that you just want to search. So as you can see here, you will get up quite a few cards there. Now you can actually pick them up for 250, sell them on for 300 coins, because there's not many in the market or you can go here be a little bit more patient do 150 coin and then you will find a few up there's you're not going to find many but then you can basically uh, start bidding on them for like 100 or like you can basically bid on them for 200 coins so you can pick them up for 200 coins instead of 300 or uh, instead of 250 coins and as you can see we don't have that many on the market right now that is a little bit unfortunate because uh, yeah i'm recording this video right now and um but what you could do is that you can go 200 coins, maximum price, and then you can just go a little bit further back in the pages here. And they can try to start, find someone that have a, or doesn't basically have a buy or a bid, basically. That is basically what you want to find. So as you can see, the, all of these have a bid uh, or a bid right now. So you can just scroll through um, to like one of the last pages here. If you can just scroll and scroll and scroll through to like the 59th minute. You can basically, to the, everyone that's been added to the market for like 150 coins or 200 coins, you can just place quick bid, uh, bids on for like only yeah, 150 coins or 200 coins basically I would say you should bid on every one of these for 200 coins so go through the last page and just refresh the market and yeah just wait for them to uh, to pop up and then bid on them for 200 coins and then sell them on for 300 coins this is what you can do with the fees of coaches as well I will check out their price right now I believe their price is about 250 coins and uh, so I will search that up right now yeah, as you can see, they are, there are a few on the market for 250 coins. So basically, you want to do the same thing. Is that now you want to go max price for 150 coins. You want to go to the last page, and then you want to start bidding on them. You can go to the last page if you want, or you can also do this. But then you are not basically not going to make that much profit. If you bid 200 on them, and you sell them for 250, you're not really going to make that much profit. But you basically, again, want to go to the, like, the 59th minute of the pages, until like the, the first one's being added to the market and stuff. And then you just want to bid on them straight away for either 150 coins or 200 coins. And then you can basically make... 50 coins uh, on each physio card uh, or physio coaches card there's no tax either because you're trading with so a little amount a little amount of money plus you can do this with fitness coaches and make like 100 coins on them so you can also do this with managers but i've uh, covered that in another video so now we can go to head coaches as well see how much they go for we can check 250 coins here see if there's any rare ones you basically want to bid on the rare ones that is what you have to have to note down so you can go 300 coins here See if there's anything for 300 coins. There is a few here for 300 coins. So again, I want to go buy uh, maximum price 200 coins right here. And I go to the last page. I want to go to the last page. And then I want to start bidding on the ones that are just being added to the market for like, you know, 150 coins, 200 coins. If you if you get basically the first bid, that is good because these are going for 200 coins. No one is going to bid more than that. So if you pick them up for like 200 coins, you bid on them straight away for 200 coins. And basically then you are going to be winning them for 200 coins. And that means that you are going to be making some like 100 coins on the each card on all of these cards you can definitely sell them for like yeah, for the for the amount that i've shown you guys in this uh, in this video right here because they don't go for more than that so you can basically for example these cards you can sell for 300 coins because there's not many on the market and yeah definitely go ask and get this method to go guys it's a really good trading method not many people know about this i didn't even know about this until earlier today so say guys hopefully you guys enjoyed it and yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow and no, actually i'll see you guys later today with a few more videos goodbye guys